Put down your petri dishes. Welcome to the 33rd first annual Ig Nobel Prize Ceremony. The Ig Nobels are tongue-in-cheek prizes awarded for bold as hell scientific research that first makes you laugh, then makes you think... They also get money, a Zimbabwean $10 trillion bill. Okay. In a thrilling webcast, I was stoked to see my boy John Zelazowicz win the Chemistry and Geology Prize. We're explaining why many scientists like to lick rocks. Because something that's not very clear then becomes much clearer. Here is your $10 trillion bill. As I predicted, the Mechanical Engineering Prize was given for reanimating dead spiders to use as mechanical gripping tools. Using the necromotic gripper, we picked up delicate objects as well as objects heavier than the gripper itself. The Public Health Prize was awarded to the guy who invented a toilet that takes photos of Uranus and can analyze your waste. Huzzah! That actually uh, caused lots of problem, privacy problem, because we're collecting all the data. Yes! Nothing to sniff at, the medicine prize was awarded for using cadavers to explore whether there's an equal number of hairs in each of a person's two nostrils. There were about 120 nose hairs on the left nostril, then 112 for the mean nose hairs on the right. We also found that the hairs tended to grow mainly in the frontal location of the nose. And finally, the nutrition prize went to peeps who've invented electric chopsticks that make bland, healthy food taste better. It can increase the saltiness of food. How can I get one? It is being commercialized. There you have it. Science for the win. Now, the traditional Ig Nobel goodbye speech. Goodbye. So wow. great. Wow. I think that last I'm one was... I'm still in shock about your love of astronomy what? and your reference to the forbidden planet. <laughs> No, I Uranus. Wasn't, I, wasn't, yes. I was shocked and so was Tom. Oh, we were shocked. That ain't his and camera. he's incognito. I'm in incognito. You don't need a special toilet for that. You can just use your iPhone, right? No, just <laughs> use me. Like, you're not can touching I, my iPhone, Sarah. Can I just point out, I don't, I don't think the point of it... <laughs> Hang on, can we check your photo no. history? <laughs> no. I don't think the aim is the footage. I don't think that's what it's about. Right, Isn't right, it? Okay. No, no. Well, what are you yeah. putting a camera down there? The what? The are you a camera up there? I think the idea of the smart toilets is it can then assess what is in your way. Well, that's why you that have a look. <laughs> that's a See? biological imperative. Like, people are always like, hey, man, people look at that. But that's your biological imperative as an animal to look at how things are working Do in the system. Do you know what's system. coming out? You don't, you don't have to stop looking, Kate. You can keep looking. <laughs> <laughs> you it's look. just this toilet might find a health problem quickly. That's all. The spiders okay. were cool. Sorry? Yeah, the spiders were oh, cool. Oh, the spiders, the spiders were really cool. And those chopsticks, far too useful <laughs> for an award I, like well, that. I thought it was all great. It was all great, but we got really focused on one thing <laughs> then, didn't we? Because it was shocking. The yeah. Now, guys, I...